Precious State Gamer 7, and I'm here with a reaction video. This, of course, if you sort of know what's going on in the Sims community, already probably know what this is about. Also, I'm a little bit, I mean, it's the same day that the trailer came out, but um, I'm a little bit behind because I actually was working today when the trailer came out. It actually came out seven hours ago, so you can see, like, it came out pretty early. I think I had just gotten to work, or it was, like, very close to when I got to work. It actually um, went up, and then I had, I got home. It's, like, 8.35 for me. I got home around, when did I get home? I got home at, like, 7.30. So it's been about an hour or so. I ate and things like that. But I probably look a little bit of a mess because, again, I've been working all day. My room, I don't run my air conditioner when I'm gone unless I know I'm only going to be gone for a few hours. Then I'll leave it running. But if I'm going to be gone for a really long time, one, I don't know what the weather changes are going to be. But also, just because I'm not in there, that's sort of a waste of energy. And uh, since I'm not going to be in there a really long time. So I did have my air conditioner running. Um, as I was eating, hoping that it would cool my room down, but it hasn't fully cooled my room down yet, so my face may have a little bit of redness, and I may just look like poop, because I've been working all day. I worked, it's one of my shorter shifts. I worked, I think, seven hours, but my break is an hour, so technically I was there for eight hours, and then on top of that, I have a 40 to, like, well, 35 to 45 minute drive, depending on how traffic is, to and back, so you add... Over another hour onto that. <laughs> so anyway, let's actually get going. I, I already can tell you that this, just on their like little YouTube page, they now have The Sims 4 Get Famous up here. And it looks like, you know, a movie set. So it looks like, I'm assuming that there's definitely, by the looks of it, going to be like some sort of actor, actor or actress career type thing going on, movie star. And considering I have a career that is a modded career for actor actress, that'd be nice that I can take that out and now have like an actual official EA version of it. So it's actually really, really nice that that is now an option. But yeah, I have this going up here. So I'm going to go actually now click on the trailer. I'm going to pause it and I'm going to turn them. I'm not going to necessarily mute the music. I'm just going to turn it down a little bit. And where I can barely hear it and put full screen on and I'm gonna watch it I haven't watched it at all I've gotten little blitz and glimpses of things throughout the day because I was on Twitter somewhat but for the most part I wasn't even on Twitter much the only reason why I was on Twitter is because yesterday um, as I'm watching this I released my October collab startup video and I've actually had quite a few people already interested in it I think I only have four or three spots already left so I was rep replying to people about that over on Twitter and trying to get that all organized. So every once in a while I caught glimpses of things here and there that people were saying as I was doing that, but I really didn't get time to look at it since I was at work. So this is going to be like basically completely fresh and new to me. So let's see what we got going on here. It's still pretty. Ooh. And it sounds it seems like oh is this like her when she first started? Okay, I need to not talk too much. I don't want the music to be too awful loud just because um, of things, but you know. Oh hey, interesting. Shooby shooby. What? I'm getting pretty hyped about this man. Okay, so that was the official trailer. I didn't want to totally mute the music, but I didn't want it so loud because it can technically get copyrighted. Now I'm going to mute it, actually, but I really did like the music going to it, going behind it. So I assume that, you know, there is going to be some new music coming with this pack. So just going to sort of go frame by frame. This definitely looks, this looks different. But it looks like it could be like the outskirts of San Mashudo. 
but I can't tell if these are like actually like just a view or if this is an area that you can build in as a new town. I am expecting. Um, did it say if it was? Wait, <laughs> hold on. Is it, 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 okay, no, cancel. I just I don't want to see all that either. Um, I no stop. Don't play. Oh my goodness gracious. Stop it. When you can't get things worked the way that you want them to, go back, please. I want you to pause and let me go to the end, please. <laughs> and then go to this. Okay. So my thing is... I'm trying to figure out... I think it's an expansion pack. From what I've been hearing, it is an expansion pack. And normally... Hold on, I gotta check something. Okay, so yeah, I needed to- I was pretty sure it was an expansion pack, and I know there was a way to differentiate- I don't know if it actually said it somewhere in this, and I missed it, but the- This being down here like it is, is definitely something that only the actual expansion packs have had. The game packs and stuff packs look different, so this is a full-on expansion pack. So I am fully expecting, since this isn't like seasons where they're having to go around and change all the towns, that there should be a new world. There should be a new world. I am hoping for a new world, and from what a lot of people were seeing and guessing even before this trailer came out, I'm pretty sure it's a new world. Now, if this is the new world, or if this is just supposed to be the outskirts, or sort of to give you an idea of it, I'm not entirely sure. So we're sort of just, you know, going to go by... So this sort of reminds me of the, um... Oh, what are they? Are the stars? Or the, um, famous actors and... Singers and all that stuff get to have a star on the- what- what is- uh, I should remember what it's called, but for some re I forget things once I start recording for some reason. But there's like a whole street of them that has like these little plaques and stars. I wonder if that's supposed to be sort of what this- This has definitely got to be the new town. Which to me looks like it would be like on the outskirts of San Mashudo. Which would make sense if for a famous one, like you have to be close to the city, I feel like. So it's like a new city- or it's like, uh, town or whatever. And it's funny, someone pointed out, and I don't think they realized it, that there's three Sims, Sim selves of YouTubers here. The only ones I'm familiar with is, uh, the Ligacy, which is the main one, which is, this is supposed to be hers. And then, uh, the Sim Supply over here. And I feel bad that I don't. I don't know. This is supposed to be the other one. And her name, I've seen her like at Twitter name, but I'm not personally familiar with her. But I did see how someone pointed out, and that's really cool that they're doing that, like with some of the game changers and stuff. So that was really cool. So there was the. Whoa. See, there was her, and there's Deligacy. So that's interesting. But yeah, you could see how people are getting excited over movie stars and over people. My thing with this, I am super excited about this, and this is one of the things that I actually sort of would think would be cool to have, but I'm hoping there is a cheat that you can do to sort of make people famous right away. One, I know that they're going to probably add some sims that are auto automatically famous, but if you know my gameplay style, I tend to get rid of a lot of the already pre-made sims just because I like having sort of my own sims in the game and sort of walking around, even if I don't play those families or anything like that, I prefer to see my own sims sort of living their lives and doing whatever. But also there's some characters in some of my, in my main, ow, I just bit my lip, <laughs> in my main save that I already imagined them to be famous. The prime example is Marie and Callie. And I would like to go ahead, like I already imagined them to like be famous and everyone would be super excited to go to the parties of theirs and things like that. So I'm hoping that there is a thing that you get to change, like you get to cheat so that you can maybe make some of your pre-existing sims a little bit higher in the fame, famous status or whatever. I don't know how it's going to fully work. I'm sure there's got to be some sort of thing that is associated with an individual sim on how famous they are and when um, sims see them out and about, you know, they recognize them as being famous. Also, this hair is pretty cool. I don't personally actually use... Max's Match or EA hairs that often unless I'm doing like a challenge but this is a really cool hair and if I seen like an alpha form of it I definitely would really like it and probably get it 
So I definitely like it. This dress is also really pretty as well. So this looks like it's rewinding her way back to how she started. Because here she is with the same haircut but a different color. So it's sort of cool how they did this. And it, as you can see, there's like... I'm wondering if this career is going to be... There's got to be a new career. There's got to be a new career. But I wonder if this career is going to be set up like the active careers. Where you actually can go. A lot of people have been wanting another active career. So I wonder if that's what, because this almost looks like it. You can see there's a lot of new clothing. There's a lot of new costumes even, it seems. Like, you know, a lot of new things. Like, they're dressing up for particular roles that they're playing. This is something new. I don't know. I can't tell what this fully is. But, you know, you definitely got some things to fool with some audio. Like, some special effects and things like that, it looks like. And stuff. That's also a new hairstyle as well. Movie set. Like, you got... This has got to be an active career, right? Right? I feel like this has got to be an active career. Wait, is this supposed to be... Is this who I think it is? Is this supposed to be... Um, oh, what is his name? Off of the mobile? There's the fashion I, like guy off of mobile. Is that supposed to be him or like a symbolization of him? Because that's what it's looking like. Ooh, I really like that hairstyle, but again... You know alpha stuff but that is a really cool hairstyle though i really like that hairstyle that also looks like a new top which i like again new costume which it seems like there's a lot of new costume that's a new hair costume hair interesting face makeup it looks like that's going to be going with it um this is the little detergent that you know laundry day had i think but this doesn't look the same so don't really know what's going on there. This is this is seriously. And there's a Void Critter outfit. Like, like the little kid shows and things like that. So that's interesting. But I mean, see, like, there's going to be so many outfits. So many. And that's really cool. That's, that's super cool. Oh, no, I started at the beginning. Oh, no. Go back. Go back. There we go. <laughs> so that's really cool. Like, so many different outfits. So, you know, they're portraying... Roll. Was there like temporary tattoos? Because that girl I don't think had tattoos yet. She just had tattoos on. And this is gonna like all these clothings look like they're coming from various different time periods. Which is gonna help a lot of people. Because I know there's a lot of people out there who does challenges. Where they do it where it's set back in later times and things like that. So that's gonna give them a lot more clothing options if they want to stick to EA and Maxis Match stuff. So, and I still use, like, the EA and Maxis Match clothing, because I don't think it and the alpha hairs cl conflict, con bleh, conflict too much. I don't think they look too weird, them two together. It, but the uh, alpha hairs and the, the alpha hairs are a little bit more. So here's, you got a limousine. These look to be new fences, but that was in, like, the little teaser thing. That is new. I like that. There. This looks really cool. I, I, the, this is a new fountain. Unless it's just a decoration for, like, a particular area and you can't actually use it and build them by. But otherwise, that's a new fountain. Was that a bodyguard? Is there, like, a bodyguard position? There's new new outfit. New stuff. Find all the new stuff. And the paparazzi people. But that's some of the things people started pointing out in the teaser. That there was paparazzi type people and things like that. You are behind the... You're in front of the red lines. And I don't think you probably should be if you're a fan. I feel like the bodyguards are doing a horrible job. Like, she had a new hair on, too. I just... Fangirling people! Is that, like... That looks different. That's different. See, there's, like, the bouncer or whatever. It's like, all serious. Like, you can't go in here. Unless... You are... A certain person. And I'm looking at them throwing out the money all over. That's that hairstyle again, but it's on a guy this time. So, can singers be famous, too? Like, is there a singing role? Or, like, you know, with the karaoke, is there a way to become famous off of singing? Also, this little girl looks like, you know, this is the best day of her life. <laughs> She's like... <laughs> what? This is gonna be interesting. I'm actually looking forward to this. There she is getting a reward type thing going on. Just her memory is seeing on everything. And there's a party. Party going on back here. That's a new hair. 
I'm trying to analyze the new new dress. There's so many, so many things. So many things. I'm I'm looking forward to this one quite a bit. Like this one's gonna be fun. So it's coming out pretty soon. I mean, yeah, it's uh f more than a month away, but technically that's not a really long time. And considering we just got seasons in what Ju June, July. There's never been two expansion packs in the same year for Sims 4. So, that's pretty big. That's a pretty big thing. And I'm looking forward to this one quite well. And that dress is absolutely beautiful. I'm just gonna say that right now. That's like a stunning dress. But, there's so many, like, there's a lot of questions I truly have. Like, is there multiple career branches? Is this, like, one career? Or is there multiple careers in it? Or is it, like, you know start off one career and has those branches like I've said. I words. <laughs> so there there's those type of questions like is maybe you can be a prof like be in the paparazzi career or maybe like it adds a branch onto pre existing careers is the, like <laughs> and then also with the free update that's coming with um the stylus thing, that's gonna go so well with this expansion, which is probably why they're, you know, the update and this is going to be around the same time because it was going to be an October update and then they said they're delaying it. I bet it comes out right before this. And that's like the pre-update for this. Oh, there's just so much. So much. I'm I'm excited about this one. I, I, I don't know. I don't know if it's reached seasons level excitement. But it's pretty high up there. I think that the Sims team is definitely working super, super hard to actually get people what they're really wanting and getting The Sims 4 to be super amazing and better than, like, the previous Sims things while still making it available for multiple people. Because that was the thing with Sims 3. It was pretty good, and it had a lot of good things about it, but the lag and all of that stuff was so bad in that game. That you had to have a super amazing computer to have all the expansions or most of the expansions. Or like, stuff packs and all that stuff. So, you had to have a really high power computer because I didn't nearly get all of the packs for it. And I had a pretty, it was a laptop granted, but it was still a pretty powerful laptop. And it still could not run Sims 3 very smoothly. So... And Sims 4 deals, like, yeah, it has issues here and there, but I think with any game that constantly has updates and packs being added onto it, that's sort of to be expected to a certain point. So, other than that, I think it's still doing a lot better. I think it's a lot more, like, easier to play for multiple um, computers versus Sims 3. So... But they're still bringing all this amazing content and all this stuff. So I'm super excited. I want to know how excited you are down in the comments below. What are some of your thoughts and theories so far? Because, like, you know, this is only a minute. And this is only the official, like, the, the reveal trailer. This is not, I don't think this is going to be, I, they'll probably have, like, one more video or something of it. Or demonstrating it, some of the things in a live stream maybe. But, you know, they've got to show off some more things before the si before 16th. But, I mean, that's still not very far away. That's That sort of surprises me, actually, how soon it is. Just because, one, we don't get... We haven't gotten two expansion packs in one year. But also, just because... It just doesn't seem... Like, it seems a while since season's been out, but not that long. That's going to be, like, only, like, four or five months in between two expansions. So... That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome. Makes me wonder if they were sort of working on this one simultaneously as Seasons was coming out already. So that they were already getting started on this one. I just... Ah, ah. <laughs> ah. Also, I'm ready for a new town. I am ready for a new town. I'm ready for... To have somewhere else for my Sims to move as well so and all the more options and career options and more careers and i'm hoping this is an active career it'd be fun to have another active career uh i don't think it should have like multiple active careers 
but I definitely think every once in a while throwing in an active career would be nice since, you know, that option is available. So that would be cool, but I'm super excited. Yeah. <laughs> I probably just made no sense. Like, my thoughts are probably all jumbled together and all that stuff, but whatever. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you're enjoy like excited as like I am for this pack and things like that. All of my other Sims 4 stuff will be down in the description below, so definitely go check those out. Um, I'm looking forward to this. I have in mind a few sims that I can already go ahead and get in the route of doing stuff like this for, but, uh, and injecting some of this in my stories, so that's something to look forward to. Also, all of my social media will be down in the description below, so if you want to go chat with me over on those, those are an option as well, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!